to this Eli Page 7 lunch. We are so happy to have you here. And thanks for the exciting video. Every brand wants to become a legend, Juni as well. Our customers, whom we consider our old friends, know very well. This 30-year-old mobile brand is famous worldwide as a device and internet mobile software. In the past years, Uni has achieved many outstanding goals in the smartphone areas. Last year, in NYC, Uni launched his first slim port smartphone, Elive S55, who many of you already know. It made the steer in mobile world, all around the world. In September 2014, Junius Elive S51 got the Guinness World Record as the thinnest smartphone. Today, Junius President Mr. William Liu will bring you another surprise, so please let's welcome him warmly. Really need. 
These are the feedbacks from our consumers. Of course, they like sleepable, but they also need long big battery. They need good camera image, but the camera should not put you. They want the phone don't to be very heat. They want good operating system. They want hi-fi and loud sound. As you all know that, it's almost impossible to achieve all this. So to summarize, all our customers, they need good design, good battery life, good cooling system, good camera image, good sound system, good network, connections, and good operating system. Of course, it's very, very challenging for Johnny to relax of this. But I want to tell you here, S7 is the one. And the philosophy of Elam S7 is sleep to perfection. We want to design a perfect sleep room. So let's first start with the design. And let's watch a video to know the main concept of S7 design. <coughs> Everything is born through a process of constant evolution. Our goal is to capture the order behind the evolution. The philosopher Ernst Cassirer once said, Science lends order to thought. Philosophy lends order to action. So what will lend order to design? We begin with parallel lines, the perfect representation of order. Within them, we discover dimension, a new standard for thickness, not just for the sake of a sleek exterior, but to sculpt a functional interior. We pursue the golden ratio to its limit and apply it to our design logic. To enable mass production, we invented double plane cutting technology. Since the alloy used in our frame is very strong, we also replace our triple plated cutting tools every 75 volts. Greatest quality. Slide your fingers down the side of the fold, and you'll discover a groove between the two polished metal lines. This design will prevent it from slipping and reduces unintended activation. After cutting, the advanced sonic buffing tool is employed to smooth the surface of the groove for comfort. The TP Nano Coating ensures the colors of front rear glass and the metal frames are the same. But these are not enough. We fit a molded screen, double-sided corning gorilla glass, a 13 megapixel camera, a 0.6 millimeter motherboard, with 858 components, a 2,750 battery, and this ultra-slim device with very limited space, we have tried our best for a step beyond perfection. E-Life S7, slim to perfection. The parallel line is a key design language of S7 because this will give us a video ultrasound of only 3.5 mm and very strong body. I think that you don't want your phone to bend like an iPhone in your pocket. You need a very solid phone. 
So maybe I think you know why the Ruby track has concave U-shaped design because the intensity of the ship can allow the Ruby track to load tons of goods and last for many years. So inspired by the design, we adopt similar design of S7 with u ship and the metal and the material is aviation level alloy. This is, I think you all know that, it's a very, very strong material. And in order to make the Sigaton more solid, the Sigaton is equipped with nanomodule plastics and stainless metal. To make the foam solid than ever before. Apart from the durable metals, we also use glass through glasses on back and the front sides to protect the device. <laughs> S7 will come with three colors Los Angeles black, North Polar white, and small dive blue. All these three colors will be available at the beginning. So, Pearl line line design concept with metal and glass. This is the key design of e life S7. Let's, let's come to battery life. Because a lot of computers, they want to achieve the thickness to sacrifice the battery life. But our target want to enable our users to use the Archer Semiphone for one day without charging. So there are two ways to achieve this. One is we get bigger battery capacity. And another is we try to lower the power consumption. So S7 is equipped with one battery of 2,750. I think yesterday there's one phone called S6 launched the battery is only 2,600 and with 6.8 millimeter. Later I will tell you that the thickness of S5 port, uh, sorry, S7, you will know that the, the thickness is much lower and the battery is bigger. And the thickness of the battery is only 3.2 millimeters and the capacity versus this thing is 595 which is almost the biggest capacity among the ultra slim batteries. Only big battery is not enough. Try to lower the power consumption is our effort. So we have analyzed the habits of the users based on the user 24 hours usage scenario and build our power consumption model. So on the left chart, you will see that instant message, games, videos, desktops, browsers are the most functions used. And on the right chart, you will see that display, CPU, network connections, and the sensors are the key components to contribute the power. So our effort is to reduce the power consumption of the key applications and the key components. So we have used the world's slimmest Samsung Super AMOLED, which is powered by ACL technology. ACL can automatically adjust the screen brightness according to the environment to lower 25% display power consumption. And S7 is powered by MediaTek 6752. This is one 16-bit optical processor powered by HPM technology. HPM will reduce 40% power consumption but increase 40% performance. And S7 is also used one sensor hub from Frisco, which can deal with most of the requests from the sensors, such as compass, accelerators, etc. 
which will increase the efficiency of the sensor perception and reduce the CPU wait times by 20%. Phone on standby also consumes a lot of powers. So in our E6, we have launched our hybrid synchronization technology. And today, we also upgrade the technology to reduce the wake up times of the system by 70, 75%. And also, we have designed green background. On green background, it will not allow the self-activation of the applications to reduce the power. According to the self-luminous feature of MLAN, we have optimized the colors of the interface and designed dark theme. So this created a comparison of the dark theme and default theme. So 30% power of the display is zero. Based on our power consumption model, normally under, under normal circumstances, S7 can last 34.56 hours. But if all the power consumption tools in enabled, it can increase another 11.7 hours, that means 32 hours, 32% battery life increase. And this is not enough. We have also designed extreme mode. On extreme mode, the screen will be chilled into dark scene. And that means the phone, the SM message, and the clock Except these three uh, functions, all other functions will be free. That means your phone will become from a smartphone to feature phone. That means with a 20% battery capacity, the standby time will last for 30 hours. So this is our battery life. So we realize very long battery life in the ultra sleep phone. Now, let's come to our cooling system. You all know that ultra sleep phone offers some heating issues, especially in the hot areas like India, like Africa. But in S7, we want to avoid the heating issue. We worked closely with the BeerTech, have designed intelligent dynamic tuning technology, which will increase the power, the CPU computing efficiency to reduce the power consumption and lower the temperature. And we have designed polar cooling system. With polar cooling system, we are using three kinds of heating materials to fill in the gaps among the heating components to transfer the heat from eight areas to the metal frame ends up with searching different layers of the heat materials to get a better cooler environment. Here is the comparison with, with polar cooling area and without polar cooling area, uh, polar cooling system. So you can see very clearly that with polar cooling system, the heat is transferred very fast from the CPU area to the metal frame. Here is also the comparison with our one model, ultra sleep model from our computers. And the average temperature of S7 is 5 to 9 degrees lower. So with S7, you don't worry about the heating issue. Now, let's come to camera image. After Jim Cook launched iPhone 6 with the Pro 2 Gym camera, a lot of Jim Cook followers launched similar models with the much bigger Pro 2 Gym cameras. But I don't like. 
we honor Steve Jobs. We make this such a bad camera. And many people ask me, how can you make the searching mega camera flag? Because many people ask me, so, is it 80 mega? I said, it's 30 mega. So thanks to all our partners, Sony in the sensor, Lime in the lace, TTK in the motor, and Primex for the module. We worked closely together to realize the world's thinnest searching mega camera module. Because of your support, we realize the searching mega camera in an artistic phone to be flat. Hardware is not enough. We also developed software system for our camera image. We call it Image Plus. In Image Plus, we want to get the perfect quality picture. So let's, I want to highlight some key features of Image Plus. First is the night mode. You all know that in the night mode, we are trying to balance the brightness and the noise. More brightness, more noise, less brightness, less noise. But our effort is more brightness, less noise. Here in the picture we are taken here in Barcelona last night. So the left is without night mode and the right is with night mode. So with the right mode you will see very clearly that the noise is much less. So thanks to Upsoft to help us to achieve this. Thank you. We also done a lot software optimization on our survey. So the capture time of sensing is below 500 milliseconds. And the focus time is below 300 milliseconds. So S7 is one of the fastest phone, camera phone without shutter delay. S7 is equipped with a 8 mega front camera with intelligent visibility. S7 can estimate your age and your gender to give you the best suggestions for a better natural selfie photo. And we have more new and good features on Image Plus. So let's watch a video to know what more Image Plus can bring to you.
for every encounter. If I ever, I want to. Spanish boy and, a, and one Taiwanese girl. So they met in Taiwan and they used S7. And finally, S7 became the matchmaker. Okay. So, so let's come to sound system. In order to achieve the ultra thickness, a lot of companies, they all sacrifice the 3.5 standard jack or use one very small speaker. But we want to do that. S7 is equipped with hi-fi, professional hi-fi hi sound system with the GTS to build big S7 to restore the authentic sound. And cutting the 3.5 Stanjack is joke for us, so in S series we always keep the standard headset as essential function to ensure our customer to increase hi-fi level experience. So we keep 3.5 standard jack and also S7 is equipped with one professional hi-fi level headphone. In S7, we worked with AAC for one 18 by 13 speaker box, which is almost one time larger than the similar ultra speakers our competitors to get bigger volume. But only big speaker box is not enough. We also use one smart PA from AXP to get another 50 more percent volume. So have a bigger sound volume. This is our sound system. Then let's come to our network connections. Single SIM is almost the standard feature of ultra sleeping phone, but we give dual SIM. And this dual SIM can support two LG card at the same time. This is not enough. It also supports five mode and 12 bands. Will enable our users to be connected with most of the carrier networks globally. So this is our network connections. So finally, let's come to 